this is how you make pancake spaghetti. Yes, it is pancake spaghetti, guys, but no, we're not using any actual pasta. So what this is, is making your pancake into long, stringy, noodle-like shapes. So as you see, I have my pancake batter here. I always like to put it in a bottle, but you can also put it into a bag. And you can use whatever pancake batter you like. So use your favorite one. You can use the ones with the protein in it. I mean, you, you can really use whatever you want. And after you've made your spiral, go ahead, let it sit. And once you see the bubbles, you can go ahead and turn it over. Now make sure that you spray your pan prior. That way nothing is sticking, okay? And go ahead and make as many pancakes as you want. Make as many of the spaghetti as you want. And once you feel like you have enough, then we're gonna go ahead and get to topping it. Okay guys, this is such a fun way to enjoy pancakes, so I highly recommend trying this out, okay? You can make thin spaghetti-like noodles or you can do something thicker, kind of like this one right here. It's a little bit thicker. And once you have all of them and they all look so, so good, you can go ahead and play around with the plating as well. I mean, there is just so much that you can do. I mean, it's actually crazy, guys, okay? Show this to your kids and let's get to topping it. This is all ready to go, guys. So what we're gonna go ahead and do now is top it. So right here, I have some powdered sugar. I have our sift and we're gonna go ahead and start putting on our powdered sugar just like this all around it. Perfect. I always like to put powdered sugar because I think it tastes so good on pancakes. Now up next, we're gonna go ahead and add some mini semi-sweet chocolate chips. Okay guys, I think chocolate chips and pancakes or even waffles go so, so good together. So I always put some on these, okay? There we go, perfect. And I always like to throw some around the plate as well. Perfect. Now that we have our chocolate chips on here, we're gonna throw some nut topping on. So what's really fun with these spaghetti pancakes is you can really make them however you want, right? You can have fun with it. You could do peanut butter and jelly. I mean, so many things go fantastic with pancakes. So, you know, it's so, so fun to just mess around and, you know, try different things, right? Up next, we're gonna go ahead and add some Hershey's chocolate syrup. So I just always add a little drizzle, just like this, a nice thin little drizzle, perfect. I think chocolate goes so good with this. Up next, we have our maple syrup. Now guys, you gotta have maple syrup, right? Here we go. And you can go ahead and just toss your maple syrup right on top, okay? Perfect. Now that we have our maple syrup on, we're gonna go ahead and do some caramel. So caramel, again, just another delicious treat. You really can't go wrong with it, right? Look at that. Look at all those colors mixing together. It looks absolutely beautiful, right? Now, we have our whipped cream. This right here is my favorite ingredient, guys. I mean, whipped cream on pancakes, whipped cream on pie, whipped cream on, you know, donuts. Whipped cream goes absolutely phenomenal on everything, right? So I always put our whipped cream right around the edges. That way we can dip it into it. And of course, we gotta throw some right on top just like that and now that we have our whipped cream right on top i always like to get some chocolate chips kind of drizzle it right on top and we're going to grab a little bit of our nuts as well drizzle that right on top as well and i think this looks so perfect guys check this out let me go ahead and spin it for you oh my goodness this looks phenomenal I hope that you guys go ahead and try this out. Let me know if you do something different and let me know what you think, okay?